The first time I came to CCV was about three years ago um, when our son Nick was 15 years old and uh, was on a mission trip for the very first time to Guatemala. And uh, so we came on that uh, Sunday when he was away in order to learn more about what, you know, where he was, who he was with, and uh, what he was doing. And it was different for us. I grew up Catholic and it was a very unique environment. Um, but something that we really felt was just a, a great place for our kids and we're very happy that he found uh, CCV. It wasn't soon after the, uh, our son came back from Guatemala on a mission that he had decided on his own to get baptized and even though he had been baptized in Catholic Church as an infant, this was the first time it was him making that independent choice and we were really proud of him and uh, all the kids went down to the Schuylkill River uh, after riot uh, one Sunday in summer and uh, he got baptized there and you could tell it was a it was a new moment it was a, a fresh beginning for him and then uh, about a year later uh, our daughter asked our son Nick to baptize her um, along with uh, Melissa and uh, it was such a great thing for her um, it led me to just a month ago ask both of them to baptize me uh, when we were together in Costa Rica and we were at the base of a 120 foot waterfall and I really didn't think it was going to be like a major impact on me but it really was. It was a, a total fresh start rejuvenating me and making me realize this is the start of my Christian journey um, that I'm really excited about and I'm very uh, proud that my kids uh, baptized me because they led, led, led us here, they led our family here. And so it was a, uh, just a, a great moment that I'll never forget. If my kids had never come to CCV, um, I really think that we, we would not be as close a family. Um, we probably wouldn't uh, have as uh, strong a connection, not only to each other, but to God. So I feel like it's a, uh, it's a great thing that, we found, uh, that our kids found this place. My name is Chris Panero, and that's my story.